A new building and playground was declared open for students at the Dhamma School and Early Childhood Development Centre at the Mukulana Shri Sugata Abhinavaramiya in Moragoda Vavala in Dabula under phase two of the News First Come at the initiative. <laughs> The project was undertaken under the guidance of the Chief Prelate of Japan and Chairman of the Sri Lanka Mahabodhi Society, Venerable Banagalopati Sitra, while Sri Lankan Japanese businessman Samantha Pereira and businessman Johan Palmula provided the funding for the project. The Mahasangha, led by the chief incumbent of the Sri Sugata Abhinavaramaya, Venerable Koska Hinne Jinananda Thera, villagers and members of the News First team were present at the occasion. In truth, the Sirius organization is not bound to carry out such tasks, but the Sirius organization has come to such rural villages across Sri Lanka. They have inquired into the shortcomings and addressed these issues. We have seen the Sirius logo. We see the faces of some of the people here on the Sirius channel, but no one knows who the great man behind this is. There is, there is no one here who has seen him. He is like a god. We do not see the gods, do we? The gods only help us. Since he travels all over the world, he has seen how our villages, our people and our children suffer. He has instructed that this task be undertaken as one step towards freeing the people from this suffering. I'm truly happy that I have been able to support the government the program from overseas. They have gone from door to door through the gum at the program. They walk for miles drinking water from coconut shells to quench their thirst, eating whatever they can find to fill their stomachs. They left behind their luxury lives, came to these villagers, listened to the problems of these people and provided solutions. I do not have words to explain these benevolent deeds. I am extremely happy that we are now able to take our children to a place close to our homes. There was no space to construct a building and establish a Dhamma school. There was never an opportunity to complete this task. I express my gratitude a hundred times over to Sirasa and the people who sponsored this project.